Welcome to your Astrology and Spirituality Overview for Saturday the 16th of May. Elisa, what cards have you chosen today? Today we're using our Angels of Atlantis Oracle cards. These are just fab, aren't they? Yeah, I really absolutely love these. Let's see what card comes up for us today. So the card that comes up is Archangel Haniel and the word on this card is Willpower. Archangel Haniel is very closely linked to the moon. She's uh, often That's interesting. represented with the uh, crystal selenite. Um, but this willpower energy is very much to do with our sort of solar plexus chakra. It's a thing that pushes us forward. It's a thing that keeps us uh, disciplined and focused and um, just, just willing to push on. And sometimes we do have to have that willpower. Yeah, I think we're going to need it today in a way, to be honest, because the astrology sees the moon passing over Neptune, and therefore it's moved on from that opposition I told you about in Sagittarius, the T-square, and it's now moved round, it's merging into Neptune today, and therefore squaring to Venus in Gemini, which of course is now in retrograde. So I think our feelings today are going to be hypersensitive, but... If you are someone who is very intuitive, is psychic in some way, even if you don't broadcast that, or something that's very private to you, or you surprise yourself by the amount of times you think, I knew you were going to ring as so-and-so rings you, that kind of stuff can really be heightened today. But so can our sense of perhaps any raw, more, um, more unprocessed sensitivities can be very 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 delicate today right, i feel right wow gosh so it, so that fits in very yeah, well yeah and it might be card. worth reaching out to that archangel haniel for, for maybe some support with that that's so beautiful mm. well thank you so much for joining us here today and obviously the weekends we found it a kind of the most changed time in a way we do tend to end up working which we know is naughty mm. probably seven days a week in some way or another but we try to do a bit less, obviously, at the weekends. But Saturday is quite a challenging day because, um, you know, a lot of people are sports fans, a lot of men particularly, but not exclusively as sports fans. A lot of the calendar has been wiped out. And also uh, the pub in England, going to the pub on a Saturday night is quite a big thing for a lot of us particularly Elisa. Yeah, well, and I, li I. I like the, you know, when you get dressed up and you get to go out and, you know, we just haven't had that for weeks and weeks and weeks, so I am missing that a little bit. Yeah, so Saturdays can be mm. the hardest day because I think if we're, we are working from home or we're trying to sort of have some kind of structure in our lives, we don't really have the difference at the weekend that perhaps no. we have had in the past. So I think today we could feel particularly sensitive about that, but I think generally there is going to be more news coming through about an ability to be a bit freer, even if we have to be a bit disciplined and guarded about the way we go about it. Right, wow, gosh. Well, thank you. Thank that. you. Thank you. If you would like to book a one-to-one -one personally with Patrick, you can find that information in the description box beneath the Please video. check out my testimonials. Mm -hmm. And if you'd like to read your daily horoscope, you can also find that in the description box. Thank you so much, Elisa. Have a wonderful Saturday. Lots of love from us both. And it's goodbye from... Him. And it's goodbye from her. Goodbye. Goodbye.